Grau. Hello, this is uh, Chef Andros. Hello, everybody. Um, this is part two uh, of my filleting of the tuna. And uh, I have the final product. Um, so I finished my work. It was done slowly for you to watch. Um, so this is what, what I managed uh, to take out. These are the four fillets uh, of the tuna. You see, we cut it like a cross. And so these are the four fillets. We have the two lower and the two higher fillets. And I managed to make four kilos, 170 grams, out of my 8.35 uh, uh, kilogram tuna. So these were the four fillets. Over and above, I managed to trim out, to scoop out actually, a half a kilogram, 500 grams of mincemeat that I will turn into, into nice um, fish balls. And I managed to take out uh, this, um, uh, these trimmings, these chunks, that um, they are nice uh, big pieces, as you can see. You see, they are nice uh, big pieces. This is a nice uh, belly uh, piece, and this is the other belly piece. So these are 600 grams of chunks that we can cook uh, moderately and uh, out of these 600 uh, grams of, of tuna chunks I could make four uh, salad niçoise. Four salads niçoise. Niçoise salad is um, uh, a salad that the great chef Escoffier uh, prepared about a century ago. So, this is 600 uh, grams of, of chunks that we can make into salad niçoise, or we can make them grilled, or we can make uh, things, um, other, other recipes uh, as we like. We can cook it and put it on top of pasta. Okay, so this is 600 grams, the, the 500 grams, and these are the four fillets that we can cut into fillet steaks the same way like we, we treat a beef fillet steak. So, um, I will, just for, just for demonstration purposes, I will cut for you, or rather I could uh, just show you how it could be done. So let's take the one fillet. So this is approximately one kilogram. I think that I could make um, uh, four or five portions. I don't know, uh, it depends um, uh, who is eating. I am about 100 kilograms. I think I could finish 250 grams easily. So if it was four persons like me, I could say that I will cut this in four, in four fillets and uh, cook them medium rare, may, maybe medium. Uh, definitely not overcooked. So this is the one fillet that, that we can cut into smaller uh, uh, slices. Okay, this is the other fillet, that's two fillets, three fillets, four fillets. So my dear friends, my dear students, that uh, I am uh, so happy that you are watching me. And uh, please uh, leave your messages. If you want any personal assistance, uh, please leave me a message. Make a comment below my video. I will find your comment definitely and be sure that they will answer to you. Uh, so if you want any more details, um, I don't want, uh, you know, to, uh, to tell you how to cook the tuna. In every country, you see, you have uh, your own um, uh, cuisine. Some people want it spicy, some they want it uh, raw, some people they want it in so different ways. So, uh, personally, I am living in the Mediterranean Sea. What I would do, I would use 
olive oil uh, to make my salmon sauté or I can marinate my salmon in, in olive oil and some lemon juice. We can put different spices like oregano, like thyme, like uh, black pepper. Uh, or we can grill our tuna on real charcoal like we cook our kebabs. So this is uh, Chef Andros. Um, just uh, once again, I tell you that um, out of the 10 kilo uh, tuna, 10 kilos was the fish as it was uh, taken out of the sea. Uh, out of the 10 kilos, uh, we had 8.35 kilos without the gills and the inlets. So out of the 8.35 um, uh, kilos, I managed to make 5 kilos, 270 grams. 5 kilos and a quarter, uh, which is a very fair price. It is less than 5 euros uh, a kilogram. Once uh, you are a skilled uh, a cook, you, you, you will fillet it yourself and it will be much more economic. So, I wish that, um, that you liked uh, my way of filleting. So, this is the product, these are the fillets, this is, these are the chunks for the salad, and this is the mincemeat that uh, you can use your imagination and um, uh, according to your culture and, you, you, and to your skills, you can prepare your, no, your own um, uh, dishes of, of tuna. Mind you, this tuna, it is not red tuna like we find in the, in the Pacific Ocean. Um, this was um, uh, Mediterranean uh, tuna. This is the color, it is very light color. And also, the texture is, is very nice, it's very smooth, it does not smell fishy. So, I wish you uh, to become very good chefs out of the culinary schools you are attending. And uh, if you need anything from me, I will be always uh, there to help you. Thank you very much. This is Chef Andros. Bye-bye.